you buy anything from Amazon, then you need to watch all of this video. And if you know anyone that buys anything from Amazon, you need to share this video with them too. So welcome back, I'm the Black Belt Barrister, helping you to understand law and helping you get through life in general. So with the holiday season upon us and everybody buying gifts frantically left, right and centre, lots of them are going to be purchased from Amazon, either as gifts or just for yourself to treat yourself. And why not? It's Christmas, right? But when you get the box delivered to you, there's lots of different labels and barcodes all over the boxes and all over the products themselves that many of us will simply just ignore. However, I have to urge you to look for this one thing on the labels. But before I tell you what that is, just as a small disclaimer, there are going to be some exceptions to what I say. However, that said, when you get delivery of an Amazon product, if you look for the label for this label here, which begins LPN, and then very often you'll see LPN, RR in the examples that I'm talking about. If you see a label that says LPN or LPNRR, these are associated with Amazon returns. That's where a customer has already returned this product through the returns fulfillment process by Amazon. This might be because they just changed their mind and didn't even open it and just sent it back and it's come back into the fulfillment process and come out to you, the new customer, or it's been because it's been opened and there's something wrong with it, customer's not satisfied with it, they've closed it, returned it, sent it back in, and routinely Amazon will check these products and put them back into the fulfillment process. Now, before you jump up and absolutely panic, this is somewhat acceptable in some situations, whereby if there is absolutely nothing wrong with the product whatsoever and is otherwise still brand new, then there shouldn't really be an automatic problem with this because it's still a new product and we can probably all agree that it's better that these get refulfilled than go to landfill. On the other hand, if it's been opened and there is something wrong with it or it's been used and would no longer be classified as a brand new product but has somehow found its way into the refulfillment process and it's come out to you described as a new item, you can have this flagged up to you by checking the labels as they come into you because if you see LPN or LPN RR or something similar on the label, now that might be on the product or the box itself, then this would flag to you that this might well be a product that's previously been returned and is no longer brand new or not necessarily brand new. So my suggestion in those situations would be to check all of the packaging, to check whether it's been opened, whether it's been used, whether there's anything missing, whether there are any scratches, defects, and these kind of things. And if there are, you can rely on your consumer rights. In most cases, there are some exceptions, but in most cases, you can just initiate a return within 14 days, beginning the day that you receive the product. That is thanks to the Consumer Contracts Regulations of 2013 and the rights that are upheld in the Consumer Rights Act 2015. I've done lots of videos on those. You can check my video library by going to my channel and then click videos and you can learn a lot more about consumer rights that I help to fight for you on this channel. So please like the video if you found that a useful insight, share it with somebody that you think won't already know about this, and obviously please subscribe and hit the bell icon so you get notifications of new video. And as always, thanks for watching.